The ingredients are smoked jalapeno sauce. Real simple. Jalapenos, sweet onion, garlic, and a little salt. Today I'm using the BR4 bull rack system. And this particular system is designed for the Louisiana grills, Traegers, and any kind of barrel grill or barrel smoker. Don't forget to give your trays a little spritz with a good cooking spray for easier cleanup. All right, my bull rack system is all loaded up. I got four trays, eight pounds of jalapenos on here, uh, two uh, sweet onions, and a cup of garlic. Here we are in the Louisiana wood pellet grill. Got our temperature set at 180. The lowest it will go. I want to do a low smoke on it. We're going to give it an hour and come back and check it. We're loaded with uh, Pacific pellets pecan. And I got the smoke tube with a little more pecan pellets in it for that kiss of smoke. I want a little extra smoke flavor in here. I'm looking for a smoky sauce. Not necessarily looking to cook our peppers. I just want to soften them a little bit and get that smoky kiss of smoke in there. I'm on the grill for about an hour now at 180 degrees. You can see my garlic is picking up real nice color from the smoke. Jalapenos are coming along, starting to sweat a little bit. I think we'll give it another half hour or so and come check it again. All right, two hours in the smoke now. The jalapenos are softened up nicely. Everything's got a nice uh, smoky golden glaze to it. My amazing tube is still putting out real well. So I think I'm going to pull them, let them cool, then uh, do the next step. Catch you in the kitchen. This is just one tray of the jalapenos. I've actually got eight pounds of jalapenos, three trays. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut the stems off of them and probably cut them in thirds and throw them into the food processor and do this in batches since there's so many of them. All right, this is what it looks like my first batch. I'm trying to puree it and it's still a little rough yet, but I'm gonna cook it for about 20 minutes, you know, simmer it, and then I'll do it again. I was just thinking it was just too much for the processor at one time. Bring to a boil, oh, about four minutes, four or five minutes or so, and then turn the fire down a little bit and uh, simmer it for about 20 minutes. Smells really strong and jalapeno -y in here. <laughs> well, I'm done cooking my sauce as much as I'm going to. And you can see by the spoon standing straight up in it, it might still be a little on the thick side. And there it is. A minute or two in the blender changes the whole texture and consistency. And the color. Smoky jalapeno sauce. Now let's eat.